Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday I posted a video that Microsoft had announced major Outlook security changes and that they would also be retiring some legacy features from Outlook. And I'll leave that video in the end screen if you would be interested. Now, over and above um, those changes, Microsoft has, in a recent blog post, announced that a Copilot, apparently, is now available in the classic Outlook for Windows. So Microsoft really pushing the AI now into all their different products and services. And uh, um, Microsoft in that blog post has said that Copilot features that are available for the classic Outlook uh, for Windows app, and if we head to an image provided from that blog post, will include summarize, which as we can see, can offer and give you a quick summary of the emails in a long thread of replies. And it's available via the new summarize button here in the top right corner when you open an email, as we can see. And basically, Microsoft has mentioned from that blog post that Copilot in Outlook allows you to draft emails, ask questions, summarize multiple email conversations, and connect across your enterprise data, including chats, documents, meetings, and emails without leaving Outlook. Now, other Copilot features um, coming to the classic Outlook um, will include coaching, which according to Microsoft will give you tips on how to write a better email and draft, which can create a full email message with just a few text prompts that can be edited later. Now, Microsoft has also mentioned that later in June, they will also add the Copilot for Microsoft 365 chat experience to the classic Outlook app uh, for the current user channels. And this will be followed up um, by users on the monthly enterprise channel sometime in August. And Microsoft has also mentioned that they are also planning to add more Copilot features to the classic Outlook a Windows app in the future, but they've also mentioned with that announcement that they also expect that key Copilot features that come to the new Outlook for Windows, uh, the web, mobile, and Mac will also come to Classic Outlook within a reasonable follow-up time depending on the feature. And in true Classic Microsoft style, they don't give us an exact date and time, but nonetheless, just wanted to keep you guys posted because I do know that quite a lot of you are still using the Classic Outlook for Windows and haven't migrated over yet to the new Outlook for Windows, which is going to become the default for Windows 11 in the future. And just wanted to let you know that Copilot, if you would be interested, is now available in the classic Outlook for Windows. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.